I'm in Lafayette, Louisiana, and something unique to the area has caught my eye. drive through daiquiris. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing very well. Yes, sir. Um, what would you recommend, actually? Uh, pretty much number one, Frank says he likes. Okay, sure, I'll go for that, please. Okay, what size? Um, I'll have a 20 ounce. In 1981, David Irvin opened the first drive through daiquiri stand, the daiquiri factory, in Lafayette, before Louisiana had enacted any laws prohibiting drinking and driving. Only a few months later, legislation was put forth outlawing open containers and cars. But on the same day as the ordinance passed, David held a promotional event at the Daiquiri factory, introducing new clothes containers. The same exact cup, just sealed with a piece of plastic tape, securing the lid and covering the straw hole. The loophole held up, permitting the sale of frozen drive through daiquiris in these clothes containers, and making the drive through daiquiri a Louisiana staple to this day. Great, thank you very much, cheers. Looks great. <laughs> How much is that? Uh, nine, please. Nine, cool. That's grand. Thank you, Thank you. Cheers. Happy holiday as well. Thanks very much. Yeah. You too. You are not from here, huh? No, I'm from Ireland. I'm visiting. Where? Ireland, Dublin, Ireland. Ireland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Very well, come to Louisiana. Thanks very much. I'll have a good time. Have Cheers. Good time. So that's the drink I've been handed anyway. Very <laughs> ornate. So there you go, for nine dollars, you get a, a daiquiri with all the trimmings from Frankie's. As long as the straw is not in the container, it's perfectly legal. It doesn't count as an open container, and you can drive around with it. But uh, I'm gonna go and enjoy this now.